Everyone thinks they know Mars, the red planet, the next frontier, the future of humanity. But there's a lot they don't tell you. First, Mars isn't actually red. Up close, it's more of a butterscotch. The red hue comes from rusted dust in its thin atmosphere. And that atmosphere? It's 100 times thinner than Earth's, with almost no oxygen and lots of carbon dioxide. If you tried to breathe on Mars without a suit, your blood would literally boil in your veins, not from heat, but from pressure loss. Gravity? It's only 38% of Earth's. You could jump three times higher, but you'd age slower, too, by nanoseconds. Mars has the largest volcano in the solar system, Olympus Mons. It's over twice the height of Mount Everest, and it's so wide it would cover all of France. And yet, if you stood on it, you wouldn't even notice the slope. It's that gradual. Now imagine this. If Earth had no magnetic field, it would look like Mars, dry, stripped of its atmosphere, and lifeless. Because once Mars had rivers, lakes, maybe oceans, but something changed. Its magnetic field collapsed. Solar wind erased its air. The water vanished. Mars is more than just a dusty rock. It's a warning of what a living planet can become if its protection fails.